Starbucks announced today that they have appointed a new CEO, Brian Nickel, to take over the company. And this has been a big shakeup since their previous CEO took over just over a year ago. But Starbucks has been struggling. Their sales have been slumping for a few months now. And people, especially on Wall Street, are really excited and hopeful that Nickel will be able to turn around the company. He's had success at Chipotle and Taco Bell previously, helping to send their shares skyrocketing at Chipotle 50% in just the past year. The leadership takeover has gotten a stamp of approval from the predecessor, Howard Schultz, who led the company for a few decades. He had been outspoken and criticizing the company's business model after he left, but he has said that he approves of Nickel and thinks he'll do a good job turning the company around. Starbucks has been struggling for a few years, and a lot of investors have speculated it's because of a loss of identity. Since the company was really created with an ideology of a third place in mind, that consumers could go there, sit for a long time in between work and home, but it's lost that appeal. A lot of locations have metal chairs and tables now, and they're not really ready after all these years to deal with the grab-and-go customer, which is why they're seeing lines and wait times of up to 40 minutes. So investors are hopeful that Nickel will be able to fix this problem for Starbucks.